One of the questions I often get asked is how am I as an injured person going to be able to pay for the medical expenses that I've incurred as a result of a car accident that wasn't my fault? Well, there's several ways to do that. One might be to submit your medical expenses to your own insurance company if you have health insurance. Another way is if you were injured while you were on the job and it was somebody else's fault, your workers' compensation insurance will still pay those expenses during that time. Or third, it might be that you have what's called a med pay provision in your insurance policy. This is a policy that says we'll pay up to $1,000 or $5,000 um, depending on what you've purchased for any medical expenses incurred by you or anybody else in your vehicle regardless of fault. Now let's assume you don't have any of those things and you get involved in an accident. You're coming home from church one day, someone runs a red light, they strike you, and you don't have health insurance, you don't have med pay, and of course you're not working at the time. How are you going to get the treatment that you need during the time that you're, you, know, you need it the most? Now if you have a wad of cash, then you can use it and pay cash for the doctor, but most of us don't have a wad of cash hanging around. So one of the ways that has, has been designed by doctors and lawyers and others is to do a medical care on a lean basis. What that means is this, is the doctor will treat you for the injuries you have as a result of the accident and forego payment or wait for payment until you complete your case with the other party. In other words, let's say you incur three or four thousand dollars worth of medical care and you've gotten all the treatment you need and you've recovered from your injuries, but you haven't paid the doctor. Well, with working with a good personal injury attorney, he or she will then reach out to the other side's insurance company to help resolve the case and from that sum of money that they use to settle your case, your doctor will be paid for the services he or she gave you. Now, you know, a doctor might treat you for three, four, five, six months without payment, waiting for it. So that's a great benefit to you because you're able to get rid of the pain while the doctor's waiting for his payment. So this lean system, however, is not free medical care. In other words, if you don't win your case, you will ultimately have to pay that doctor back. I'm sure he or she will work with you on a payment plan. But normally, at the end of a case, if your personal injury attorney has been successful in recovering something for you, he'll get the, your doctor paid, he'll pay your attorney's fees, and you'll get money from the settlement of your case. So that's one of, the, one of those four ways you can get your injuries paid for, or your medical care paid for, as you're recovering from a third party uh, injury.